chairman of the Ghana National Broadcasting Authority, Leslie Sobers, has dismissed claims by the opposition leader that the authority is partisan and is leveling attacks on a particular radio station. So take my statements at the last engagement and apply them to Freedom Radio as if it was a, an indication that we are going in the election period to take people off the air who are stations of the air that are sympathetic with a politi particular political party is quite fallacious. Uh, I've not heard such fallacy in a long time. According to Sobers, the Broadcasting Authority is unbiased and is in no way influenced by the government when discharging its mandate. Here you are accusing a person who's trying to do his work above board for being partisan because you want to be able to have carte blanche freedom to say what you feel and, and say disparaging things about people whenever and wherever. So I want to make it very clear to this nation that the GNBA has no such interest. But what we do have interest in is the people of Guyana being entitled to and enjoying quality broadcasting quality radio, quality television, quality cable. Sobers reminded that under his leadership, the GNBA has issued more broadcasting licenses than any other board. This board started in 2017, and between then and now, we have issued more licenses than any other board in the past. So today we have 20 or so radio broadcasters and an equal amount of television broadcasters and a fair amount, I think it's about six to ten cable broadcasters. The Ghana National Broadcasting Authority is the regulatory body responsible for overseeing all television, cable and radio broadcasters in Guyana. The GNBA was established in 2012, subsequent to the development of the 2011 Broadcasting Act. Sinka Thorne, InfoHub.